Hi, welcome to an Inventor 2022 video tutorial. I want to do that slide and tilt mechanism or that assembly now in Inventor. And it's very easy to do in Inventor. So if we move that part here, it should go like that and also back again. And I've made an angle constraint and if I drive that angle constraint from 90 to 0 degrees, you see it moves absolutely correct. And as I've already mentioned, it's very easy to do in Inventor. So let's have fun with Inventor. Okay, I've already created a new and empty assembly. So let's bring in our first part and that would be the guide plate. Let's go for step files. And of course you can download those step files from my GrabCat account. So that would be the guide plate C. Open it and just place it grounded at the origin. Bring in the second part. And that would be of course the tilting part C open it and place it somewhere. Now I will need a constraint made from this surface to that surface. Apply. And then I need just two more constraints. Maybe move it over here like that turn it around okay and that would be two more transitional constraints so go for transitional and the first surface would be this one and that should move along those chain of faces apply and the same over here with this surface along that tangent chain of faces. Confirm. And now if we move that part here, you see it moves already the way we want it to move. So that's really very, very easy to do in Inventor. Now let's move that part into that extreme position like this and now I want to add a constraint between two planes. Let's take a look which planes we can use. So that's one plane that's in the guide plate and if you use one which is normal to that one and that would be this one. So we can make an angle constraint between those two. Let's go for this one and this should be between, let's take a look between this one, let's take a look. Arrow points in this direction, that's okay. And that one points in the same direction. Great. And that would be in this case 90 degrees. And we can all give already some sort of maximum minimum and a minimum would be of course zero and the maximum would be 90 degrees. So go for 90. It will not go to zero but Anyway, we can use zero. Now, if we move it, it should still perform as wanted. Great. But now we can drive that constraint here. So go to drive from zero to 90 or 90 to zero. Let's see how many total of steps. Let's go for let's say 200 steps and let's move it from 
move it back works like a charm so i hope this was helpful hope you liked it if you did like it please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my facebook fm page it would be very nice of you i want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well thanks for watching see you to the next one bye bye